Gemma Kearney, I'm on Radio 1, Saturday, Sunday morning between 7 and 10 a.m. And um, uh, I'm on myblist.co.uk, I nearly forgot, but that's where you're watching me. <laughs> um, we're here to talk to you today about the Radio 1 Teen Awards. Uh, because it's hot enough. It's well, it's very exciting. Yeah. And the lineup looks amazing. Oh my goodness. And what, with you... the lineup being so amazing, who mm. are you going to try and spy on backstage? Um, well, it's all about, and I know every time I say these two words, I hear a ripple across the city. But one that will cross the planet. Uh, <laughs> one Direction are going to be awesome. And I know they're going to be really pulling it out of the bag. I've got a feeling, I don't know, I've got a feeling there will be surprises. For okay. Some reason. I just feel like, you know, they've got so many people there that are there just to see them. It's One Direction Day, the day before on Radio 1. Mm -hmm. It's only going to make them the stars of the show, potentially. Okay, then. But you're saying, you're saying you've got a feeling you are presenting, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So haven't they let you in on any secrets? No. Oh. No. No privileges. No privileges. Sort it out. Just a nice frock and when oh, okay. give it to me, I've got to choose one. Oh. one. <laughs> yeah, but at least, at least you get the choice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm just going to wear a nice frock and see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> Given your fashion background, if you could give someone from the lineup an award for best style, who would it go to? Um, oh, that's such a good question. Um, well, I know Emma Watson's up for an award. Oh. And uh, she came in recently. Yeah. And I just lo I've loved seeing how her style's evolved and. She just looks pretty hip these days, do you know what I mean? She's, she's rocking, so okay. I would like to, to give her a big old thumbs up and a credit for that one. Okay then, if there was someone who maybe you could, you know, I don't want to say fix, but maybe just sort out a little bit before they went on stage. <laughs> Are you are you are you are you going to be kind and say oh no well, they all look amazing? <laughs> or are you going to be honest? She's going to have to be one of the boys, isn't oh. it? <laughs> Go on, you tell you tell me. Oh, cool. Well, I'm, I'm not. Uh, this, this is a team. I don't want anyone killing me for mentioning any names. They all look amazing. I'm going to be what, nice. I'll, I'll, I'll be honest with you, right? As long as you have a big smile on your face and you're happy about what you're wearing, then everything's cool. I'll enjoy it. And I think that most people in the public eye have that swag about them. Yeah. I like that. Who do you reckon will have the messiest backstage room? <laughs> um, who will? Okay, so let me think about this. Hmm. Probably me and Grimmy. Oh. Yeah. Who more so? Grimmy, obviously. <laughs> you not heard about Grimy Grimmy? Oh. It's not stupid music. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> backtrack. Backtrack. I'm <laughs> so you're not messy at all. No. Okay. I'm well messy. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh, naughty. Yeah, yeah, I, I know, I know, it's really bad. My boyfriend tells me off all the time. My bedroom's still a mess and I'm too old for that, but it really is. So, <laughs> if you're watching, I really understand. I know, what, I know, you've just got more important things to do, right? Well, we're not here to tidy. <laughs> if you were to win an award yourself, what would it be for? Um, biggest mouth. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing, though. Yeah. Oh, you actually, you actually mean inside. <laughs> Let's go in there. Let's go. No, in there. <laughs> it's like, no, back off. Um, obviously, um, you're going to be co-hosting. Um, but during the, well, on the Saturday, you're going to be co-hosting with someone that's pretty well known. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. so we, we, we found out this week that I'll be presenting my show on Radio 1 from 8 o'clock. 8 a.m. is like an hour's lying because usually I start at 7. Mm -hmm. Just to increase the anticipation and excitement <laughs> with Liam from 1D! Oh. Ah! <laughs> be honest, be honest now, be honest. Yeah. If you had a choice, would it have been him from 1D? Well, do you know what? If I tell you the truth. Okay. I mean, everyone loves Harry, yeah? Yeah. Well, I'm happy that it's Liam. Oh, okay. Because Harry's a bit, like, tired. Oh no. Yeah, I heard him on Grimmy Show this week and he just sounded a bit sleepy. Oh. So I was like, I need someone to pet me up. Oh, okay. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm well happy for him. What if he's too hyper? What you can do then? No, 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 that's perfect. Oh. And he's got a decent quiff as well, so maybe he can give me some tips. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, obviously Liam is good enough, yeah. but if you could have another celeb to co present with, who would you choose? Oh. That's a good question. Maybe just like all the judges of X Factor. Oh, okay. Yeah, just like them just sort of popping up at various points. 
why The X Factor? Is that like your favourite show on TV? Not necessarily. I just think it would be fun. Okay. Do you know what I mean? It yeah. would just be quite nice to have Gary Barlow come and tell you everything's <laughs> alright every now and then. <laughs> Even Louis? <laughs> One award. <laughs> just for one. He, for he one. can give Hottie of the Year awards. <laughs> oh, love, love it. Um, so, as a teen awards, describe yourself in one word as a teenager. Excitable. Yeah. I still am. I still am. <laughs> what gets you really excited? Um, I don't know. Funny things. I just lots. Of, I find lots of things funny, and then they make me excited, and then it's even funnier. Oh god, it's just like one of those like constant snowball circles. effect. Yeah, yeah, snowball effect. That's what it is. What were you like at school? Um, a, a, a little bit like outspoken. Okay. Oh, again, are you surprised? <laughs> <laughs> if you could go back to school now, what would be the one thing that you do? I wish that I'd learnt Spanish properly. Oh, okay. Because I was all right, and I can remember all the foods. Yeah. <laughs> 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 but, but it would have been nice because I'm such a communicator and I like a chat. Okay. Whenever I go to a different country and I can't speak their language, I get really upset that I can't express myself. <laughs> um, Shout at them. <laughs> well, it's like, I just really want to say... I, uh, uh. So it would be nice to be able to speak a different language. Yeah, I think that's, yeah. Good. Yeah, that's a good thing. Nothing mischievous. No. Good girl at heart. Yeah. Who did you have the biggest crush on as a teenager? Um, Peter Andre. I'm it's not funny, right? <laughs> Anyone from my generation understands. <laughs> you just gotta watch the Mysterious Girl video. <laughs> who, who do you think you'd have a crush on now? Do you see, do you see how quickly I try to That's move away from Peter Andre? That's a good question. <laughs> I don't know. Oh my goodness, that is a really... I'll come back to that. Come back to yeah, that yeah. one. We've only got the one more left. Okay. And, and the question is, yeah. who would be your hero now? Who would you give in a wolf? Who's your personal hero? Oh. Oh, that, there's That's loads. another one to stump you. There'd have to be a whole awards ceremony because okay. it's most of my friends, to be honest. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, so maybe I'll have a party. Yeah. And then just give everyone a cake and then it'll be cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, that would be the award. <laughs> yeah. Just a slice of cake. So I could Go. do that yeah. the day after the Teen Awards. But I think that your heroes are usually closer to home than you'd yeah. expect. You know, yeah. the people that do make you laugh every day. Yeah. The teachers that sort you out and give you chocolate in your detention. I had one of them. She's a hero. What school's <laughs> that? <laughs> I know. It, it was a good moment. It was yeah. a good moment. Who would I fancy now? I need to know this. <laughs> Maybe Liam. Mm, do you know who's hot? Channing Tatum. Yeah. He's, he's nice. Yeah. He is. So I probably would fancy him. And he can dance. Yeah, yeah. Can he? Can we dance with him? Um, no. <laughs> but it could happen. <laughs> Don't judge me. Thank you so much for speaking to oh, us. Oh no, thank you.